everyone, this is Daniel, and today I want to give you a quick demo of how you can build your own SharePoint chatbot using Power Apps Flow and Q&A Maker. Um, so the whole uh, reason to build this is because this can be your level one technical support now for SharePoint, um, and that's a win-win situation because the um, end user uh, doesn't now need to put in a ticket, doesn't need to go and you know, make a phone call and wait. Um, you directly have this chatbot to answer those basic, simple, level one type of questions. And on the flip side, um, the IT department uh, no longer needs to spend that extra time to answer these simple questions. Uh, so that was the whole reason to build this as a demo, and um, I would like to show it to you. So what I have over here now, um, I need to log into my um, SharePoint site. And in the site over here, um, I've actually gone ahead and created this custom page um, I, I call that as chatbot, but this in this custom page page basically I've just embedded the power app that I built. So let me go ahead and actually just expand. I mean um, expand that so you can actually see the full thing. Um, and there you go. Here you actually have the um, the chatbot that I made in Power Apps, and I've actually embedded that into this modern page. Um, that's one thing. Second thing is, as you can see, the chatbot imme immediately recognizes me and puts uh, my first name, saying "Welcome, welcome, Daniel." That's because I've logged into the page over here. If somebody else did that, um, it'll be their first name. So it is pretty dynamic over here. So let's start the conversation and see how this goes. Uh, I'm just going to start by saying hi. And click on submit. And so this information is put in over here. Um, on the knowledge base side, it goes ahead and sees all the questions and answers I've trained it with. And it comes back with the most reasonable one. And the answer is pretty good. It says hello. And then I go and say, how's it going? So let's see the chatbot again looks at that assesses it and comes back with the latest uh, most similar answer that is the most applicable answer and it says so far so good how's life at your ip address and i just tried to make it a little bit more humorous over there um, so now i'm going to jump in and start asking the questions i say have a well let me just say hmm, great i have a question so let's see what the chatbot says to that the chatbot says great i have an answer i said okay well, I have a question about this site. Can you help? And so let's see if this big question, if it actually goes to that site and comes back uh, to the Power Apps, I mean the Q&A knowledge management or the knowledge base and comes back and it says, yeah, it does. Cause it says, sure, I can help anything in particular. Um, so that's good because it's, it's actually picking up the questions they're having and it actually does assess the knowledge base very well. Uh, I came back with that question. So I says, yes, I need um, access to the document library. And so with that, it says, oh, you know what? Gabriel Christian is actually the owner of this document library. You will have to contact him. And so that just made the whole process a lot more easier now. Um, remember, I didn't have to, uh, you know, search or scroll down through any FAQs or anything like that. This was just a friendly interaction with the chatbot. So now I'm just going to ask a very simple question. This is, what is Power Apps? And it says, you know, turn your business enterprise into a solution with ease. Give people what they need to drive results. And then to make it a little bit more humorous, I'm going to say, quick hide. And the chatbot to that comes back and says, what, again? And again, that was just, you know, to make it a little bit more humorous. So now I'm just gonna say, thanks. To that, um, thanks was actually not in the knowledge base of the uh, chatbot. So I'm, let me try that by saying thank you. And so that was in the knowledge base of the chatbot. So it came back with saying, um, you're welcome. So the training does involve some work um, on the Q&A side. Uh, but the overall is, is pretty good over here. Um, so now that I'm done, I go ahead and click on complete. And what happens is there's a flow that's kicking off now. And what that flow does is it actually goes ahead and now sends me the entire conversation. And here you go. It actually, this was flow. It said a copy of a conversation with chatbot and the whole discussion, even that thanks. And it came back blank. Even that is recorded and it basically sent me the entire conversation. So I have a, a copy of it in case I need to refer to that in the uh, in the, uh, in the future, uh, but you know all in all it worked out really well. It is a chatbot. 
uh, direct integration with uh, Power Apps and Flow. And I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it and stay tuned for the blog. Thanks.